돔처럼 대약 My name is Brian Farina. I am originally from Detroit, Michigan, currently living in Chicago. I got my start in this business about 14 years ago working for the Walt Disney Company. After I finished there, I started on tour with vocal group uh, Manhattan Transfer, legendary Grammy Award winning vocal group. And then from there, uh, Kurt Elling, another Grammy winning vocalist. Uh, New York Voices, many, many, many corporate events, and finally here today, uh, production manager and front of house engineer for the Sing Off Tour. The Sing Off Tour is from the hit television show, which is like a seven episode show airing in between Thanksgiving and Christmas. And this tour features three of the most popular groups, Home Free that won the show, Voice Play, as well as the Philharmonic. We are using the M480 as a direct split from the front of house, just down one Cat5 line. And basically we have one wedge mix of six wedges and we're feeding uh, multiple in-ear mixes for certain performers. Most performers are on the wedge mix. So as you can imagine, it gets a little creative trying to please everyone. So being that it, you know, it's really fast and, and easy to use, it helps make adjustments on the fly quickly. I chose the V-mixing system for the tour because I have a lot of experience with it. I own an M400 console, an M300 console, and a few of the snake pieces, as well as an R1000. So I knew the channel count was appropriate and that the Roland systems haven't ever failed on me in the past, so I knew it would be pretty good going forward. Hey, I'm Dan Glenzik, doing monitors here on the sing-off, luckily with the Roland M480. I like the size of it, it's a great little package. It's got everything you need wrapped up in one tight little box. It's easier than I thought it would be. I set this up in my garage, actually, in Chicago, and it was about negative five outside. I actually rented a space heater to do it from the, the Ace Hardware down the street. And hour and a half later, I was returning the space heater because literally I set up the connections, turned it on, locked up immediately, did a test, and I was a happy guy. I hadn't seen one before, but luckily it's very user-friendly and you can be up to speed on it in no time. Usually the first thing I do when I uh, set up of house is I'll talk into a microphone, try to get the PA zones tonally where I want them to be, where I know that they need to be for this show. And then it's so simple, I just enable the tape return inputs on the Midas and I hit play and it allows me to go through voice by voice and get EQ. If there's certain people that I struggle with from day to day trying to figure out how to put their voice, I can easily check that out and just be ready for the sound check, you know, because there's 36 performances and we're doing six shows a week, you know, one night off and I want to try and keep sound check as painless and fast as possible to save voices and save all of us from having to load in earlier than we need to and things like that. Another reason that I enjoy partnering with Roland is because they're very responsive. The support is great, tech support, tour support, everything. It's really been a, a good experience for me. I enjoy creating the experience for the audience. I could have chosen going into the studio or working corporate or in TV. I enjoy the moment, being in the moment, being a part of the creative process for a show like this and having the audience come out at the end of the day, you know, saying, man, how did you do that with 17 voices? And are they really making all those noises? If they ask me questions like that on the way out, I know that I did a good job and helped create a great experience for people. And that, that's pretty much why I do it. Yeah. 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 Yeah.